Oh, hi. Hi. Where's Christy? Oh, she had a doctor's appointment. I'm filling in for a while. Can I help you? Yeah, I'm Monique. Do we have the prints from last week's shoot? I want them for my book. Oh, hey. mm -hmm. Models Inc. Oh, could you hold on for a second? It's Rebecca. She says it's an emergency. Yes, what is it? Now is your chance. I hope you have witnesses. Adam took Daniel? Or call the police. But you told Adam on the phone that he could take Daniel. I did no such thing. And I believe a room full of witnesses heard us discuss the issue this morning. He knew I was getting a restraining order. Have my driver bring the car around. Daniel back to Grayson's right now. But I have him till 7.30. Come here. What the hell? What's the trouble, officers? That's my son, officers. And that's my ex-husband. I never give him permission to take my son. Give me the child, sir. Hey, look, I don't want any trouble here. You can't do this. She's lying to you. She called. We're required to intervene. <sighs> I suggest you both get lawyers and settle this before this goes any further. If you want a war, you got a war. Now, binding arbitration could decide custody within a matter of days, but you must abide by the judge's ruling. So all we have to do is uh, agree to a judge. Mm -hmm. Any suggestions? No, nah, they're all good. Uh, Judge Miles is more liberal. Judge Harris has children of her own, but it's really a crapshoot. Any of them will be fine. Pick a judge. They're all just names on a list to me. Unless I pick the right judge. Ms. Louder? Yes, what is it? Adam and his lawyer are here. Send them in. Leslie, good to see you. Michael, likewise. Have we reached a decision? My client agrees in principle to binding arbitration, and now it's a matter of picking a judge. Good, I see you got my facts. Those are the family law judges that are available right now. They're all reputable and fair-minded. So I'll just pick one. I've already picked one. Let's not get into all that. Or we'll be here all night. Your judge, my judge. We'll just pick one at random. There. Robert Moore. Good man. Agreed. We'll set it up as soon as possible. Excellent. Good day. Thank you, Michael. Hey, don't worry. You are the child's natural mother. There won't be any problem. Your Honor, the child's mother's demonstrated a serious lack of judgment to the extent that my client feels he must seek permanent full custody. Of course, we'll be willing to negotiate reasonable visitation rights. Mr. Louder, you've had no contact with the child for the first 18 months of his life. What brings on this sudden rush of paternal responsibility? Your Honor, my ex-wife deserted me. She didn't even tell me we had a child until very recently, so how could I have been part of my son's life? I mean, does hiding a child from his father seem like good judgment? There were reasons, Adam. Mr. Louder, you took the child without permission. That doesn't sound like very good judgment to me. I believed I had permission. Look, I'm a successful businessman. I'm renting a nice home, and I'm engaged to be married. And what do you do for a living, miss? I'm a model. Your Honor, why not appoint an independent evaluator, someone who will observe Daniel with each parent, and then you can decide which of us will provide Daniel with a better home? Mm -hmm. I'm certainly willing to do that if both parties are agreeable. Oh, we agree, Your Honor. 
And my client requests that arrangements be made as soon as possible. She wishes to spare her child any further trauma. Very well. I'll appoint a social worker who will make arrangements to observe the child in each home. And as soon as I have that report in hand, we will reconvene. Good day. You're such a fool, Adam. I could have been persuaded to share custody, but no, you had to go for everything. Now you're gonna lose everything. What's this? Do you know what walking the check means? Yeah, it means they left without paying. You'd think in a classy place like this. They probably got tired of waiting. Unfortunately for you, unpaid checks come out of your pay. Still, your hourly wages and your tips should cover this one. Oh, Hello, Carrie. I know you've just embarked on a very exciting new career in the food service industry but i just wanted to see if you'd change your mind and agree to be wined dined and romanced by a very rich very powerful man for a very attractive amount of money no grayson do you know how long you'd have to grit your teeth and smile at those overfed twits in there to make the same amount of money i could get you in one fun-filled night you want to show hillary you don't need her don't you? Well, if you come and work for me in no time, you could own Hillary. <laughs> <laughs> 